So here are the rules. You've got five minutes to gather your ingredients and to plan out what you're going to make. You have to use the ingredients in the basket. Okay, so we've got chicken. Everyone has to use some chicken. Some bean sprouts. <laughs> and bok choy. Anything else? Free game. In the fridge or freezer, check the dates. You have to use these three ingredients. Have to be somewhere in your meal. I wonder if we got something to color like mango. So what's the preliminary idea here? What are you guys thinking? My sous chef is from the south, and so we're gonna cook the modified cabbage stuff almost like collard greens, mm. and mix them up, and we're gonna get a little southern style going with a little vinegar and some spice nice. on the collard greens, on the modified collard greens. All right. It's chicken. pronounced collard greens, yeah, collard by the way, not colored <laughs> greens. <laughs> onion, garlic, so what's your preliminary plan? Parmesan chicken. Parmesan chicken, oh. Chicken right. parmesan, whatever it is. Either one, I don't know. Find salt. Try to find a seasoning. He is working on his chickens. So what are you doing right now? You're reducing the mushrooms and onions. Some mushrooms and onions. Nice. Yes. Do you put a little fresh garlic. Yeah, we got some. Hey, He needs a garlic smasher when you got those meat hooks. Have you ever made this at home? Uh, no. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I just wish I had more cream of mushrooms. That would be all right. I don't even know what I'm doing. What's that? I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> It's told for, rock salt, but it's on her left hand already. <laughs> Is that kosher? Wish my kitchen looked this clean after I was cooking. Man. Oh yeah. Everything over to one cook top preparation area. <laughs> We're currently in the middle of filming a chopped episode. What kind of salad is it? It is a kobabi, whatever, rice, cranberry, raisin. Oh, yeah.
chicken pin and mozzarella. But the good times roll. What was the word? What was the term? Les bon temps relay. Les le bon. Les bon temps relay. How much time? Crusted, covered with a nice marinara sauce. On the side, you have a bok choy and bean sprout salad with various other things in it. And mozzarella cheese. cheese. And mozzarella cheese. And raisins Mozzar and mushrooms. Enjoy. Now, I must say that the presentation is amazing. The greens yes. with the red and the noodles. This is a high quality meal here. I like how it, it has the greens and then it flows into the red with the green on top. Oh, there you go. Yeah, what I'm just mean? excited to eat it. I'm eating each individual piece. What's in your uh, marinara sauce? Tomatoes. Does <laughs> pepper? <laughs> Salt, pepper. Salt, pepper. Italian seasoning, garlic. Is it kind of an earthy taste that you're getting, Jamie? Yeah. That's the bean sprouts. Thank you. We are prepared for you today. An easy to consume, consume friendly mixture. It started out as the trinity, which was the onions, the garlic, and the bell pepper. The bell pepper. And then we added the chicken with a freshly grated Parmesan on the top. Noodles cooked to perfection, so please enjoy. Okay, is this my bocce? Uh, yeah. yeah, just like there's the set. This is, is it's just, for, it's just for decoration. This is decoration. Can we analyze the presentation? So the presentation is good. Good. Got a little bit of green on there. It's it looks like a lighter meal to, compared to the meal before. I concur. I think the food looks really good, but um, the presentation of the other one was a little bit better. Having my side salad instead of a piece of lettuce. <laughs> right here. I, I would say and that this, this, this one paper plate. This piece. reminds me of home. So like <laughs> it's a home cooked meal. Yeah. Home there you go. Here. Yeah. This one piece of lettuce threw me. <laughs> Kind of needed something to just compliment it, but I can see what I put it on there. But it was kind of I would have been just happy. With it. <coughs> you can tell it's off. You can tell it's not off. With this because then that would have matched that. Yeah. This threw it off. As far as a as a meal, like both awesome. I would say the presentation was good on that. So that's the winner for presentation. But what's the winner for food? There's the winner for food. For taste wise. How far they got? Okay. So welcome back to this episode of Chopped. <laughs> to this episode of Chopped. <laughs> we have judged. We have partaken. We have enjoyed. It was a very hard decision. Both teams did an awesome and fantastic job. It was a very difficult both, decision. Both meals were edible. Yes. <laughs> very edible though. Like I want you to make some for me to take home, Leah. Yes. <laughs> So, <laughs> the big reveal is. Ta -da! I felt like the Parmesan had a little bit more flavor and I was drawn to that flavor. So, anything I, you guys want to add? No, I'm just impressed by both of them. 
It was very, both of them were very palatable. Good. I would eat them any day of the week. Me too. So I was the same way, both are very edible. Enjoyed both of them, but when I was done, I pushed both of them to the front and I just kept thinking, which one do I want to keep going back to? And it ended up being the chicken parmesan. Very good. <laughs> well, I prefer. I look, it yeah, very it looks good. good. It looked very good. Now we got our trousers. Oh, yeah. Turn around and get the face. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cow. Right, let's make our sous chefs. We're doing an excellent job. Oh, they are amazing. Gross. And then we do have our. Second place trophy. This comes without the knife, but don't worry, you still get the anchovies. That anchovies. Toilet paper, this is eBay. Oh, 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 oh.